Welcome back to Kids on the Farm. Today, Today we're going to show you how to black house is Okay, so how does the head work? How does the head work? Mm -hmm. The corn comes in in the rows, right? Uh -huh. And if you look underneath here, see, we can't crawl under there, but there's the rollers here. Uh -huh. That'll pull the stock down, right? Uh -huh. And then the ears of the corn get grabbed by these chains okay. and they go up, okay? And then they go inside the combine, underneath the cap. Okay. And then if we walk over to the side, we can see where it takes the corn off the ears. Okay. And then here, here's a big drum. Yeah. So the corn gets put through there. You can see that there's little, here's the ears of the corn. Yeah. And there's another drum inside there that's spinning. And it rubs these against the outside here. And then the corn falls through. And then these get thrown out the back and spread out for fertilizer next year and then the corn kernels there's big tables back like a big kitchen table with holes in it behind here that we can't see but it's shaking back and forth and then the corn will fall through one more time to make sure there's no leaves in it and then it goes up in the tank and then into a wagon or the grain cart or the semis or whatever it goes in we can look in the back here we can open up the back Whoa. That's where all the, the corn stalks get thrown out, out the back, right? So if we look up in here, and we have to want the camera to see up in there. You can peek up in there too. You can see right up in here. Whoa. Right up in here. And if you come up in here, one of the times, there's some screens back here. It's kind of dark, it's hard to see. Yeah, we'll get Leaves spin, yep. I don't know, is it too dark for the camera? Yeah, these are the screens. There's one on top and then there's one right below it, just like this. And they shake back and forth. And if you can see, they're at a angle and the corn is heavy enough that it'll fall down in there. And this leaf stuff just kind of gets blown out the back. There's a big fan up in there. Nice, nice. Okay, so This corn either for feed or gas for cars. They call it ethanol. So it's like a corn gas for cars. on this glass. Correct. It's hard to see. Can you, you can't see out the back of this thing, can you? you not drive a combine without a parent. Mm-hmm. 
you do. And you do not be careful around the plate. And uh, you have to sit down when there's bumps. Yep. Really big bumps. We only stood up there because it was smooth and we know there's no bumps. And I'm not going to jerk it to a stop because that would make you fly forward. So yeah. it, you got to be careful. You're not Mm -hmm. And do not climb on the combine when it is moving. Yep. Yeah. And you guys were, even when you were standing up, Gavin, you had your hand on the railing to hold you, too. So I always want to hang on to something because this thing's yeah. bouncy. And when there's chains on the uh, outside part, and if you're even standing and holding on to a bar, don't stay inside the cab. Yep. We're going to show you actually yeah. how it unloads. So here it is. So I launched through the combine and now it's all unloaded into the um, grain car. And so it's going to load into there and then go to the semis. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and give us a big thumbs up.